Okay, how do you feel today, sir? Oh, I feel great. Very great. Okay. So, um, you know, we have some undecided voters out there. What do you want to tell them? Well, undecided voters, you are all Nigerians. You know, the phenomenon that has become failure of governance in Nigeria. You know that the APC and the PDP has failed the people of Nigeria completely. And this is an opportunity for you all to remake Nigeria. To tell the entire world that the project Nigeria is a possibility. And that the unity of Nigeria could be sustained through your voting for the Labour Party. Because the Labour Party is the only party that will serve the total interests of the people of Nigeria. Whether you are from the West, the East, the North, or the South. Labour Party has the key to unbottle the potentiality of the Nigerian people. We will move from consumption to production. And that is why you should vote for His Excellency Peter Obi for president. You vote the National Assembly, all Labour Party, top to bottom. Because without the National Assembly populated by Labour Party, it will be very difficult for Peter Obi to actualize his promise to the Nigerian people. So, if you want a new Nigeria, a Nigeria where the son and daughter of nobody becomes somebody without knowing anybody, you should think, first and foremost, Labour Party and its candidates. Labour Party candidates are verifiable. Their pedigrees are verifiable. Trust. Trust the unity and survival of Nigeria in the hands of Labour Party candidates. So that day, 25th, which is tomorrow, go cast your vote for Labour Party and go home and sleep with your two eyes closed. Because Labour Party will solve the delayed development of Nigeria. You have tried APC, PDP for 24 years. It has been failure upon failures. Give Labour Party a chance. Give its candidates a chance. And see whether the Labour Party will not make the difference in the lives of Nigerians. So, don't be intimidated. Go to the polling booths. The President Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of Nigeria, President Muhammadu Buhari, has Certainly said it publicly that go to your constituencies and vote your choices of candidates. That nobody will intimidate nobody. The armed forces of Nigeria, headed by Jira Irabo and the service chiefs, has publicly taken a position that the armed forces of Nigeria belongs to the people of Nigeria and that they will protect the voters. The IGP has said some, the director generals of the DSS, the chief of defense intelligence, Major Samuel Adebayo, all of them have maintained unity of purpose, that the unity of Nigeria is sacrosanct and that will guarantee the peace, tranquility of all Nigerian citizens as they go out and vote their choices. So don't be afraid that anybody can intimidate the Nigerian people or how they cast their votes. Any Nigerian who defies the law and takes the laws into their hands will be dealt with in accordance with the laws of the land. So don't be afraid that talks, militants, savages will intimidate any of you because the armed forces of Nigeria are your armed forces and they will protect you. The Nigerian police will protect you. The security services will provide the required intelligence that will be, that will be needed by actionable agencies to take appropriate and preemptive steps to ensure that there is a peaceful pool. So, on the side voters, do you want to continue the sufferings of the last 24 years? 
or you want a change for Nigeria, not only for yourselves and your children, but children and generations unborn. That is the responsibility that your PVC will do, and your PVC will do wonders. You hire us as your leaders with your PVCs, and you use your PVCs to fire us if we misbehave. If labor does not do well, the same way you're going to sack APC and PDP, you sack labor when they come for re-election, if they don't do well. But I can assure you that with P2B as president and us as members of the National Assembly from labor, that all your desires for Nigeria will be met. And that new Nigeria will be battered after the polls of the 2023 elections. So, have the courage, salute your nation, and have your trust on Labour Party. And that Labour Party will deliver Nigeria to a new promised land. We will live from Egypt to Jerusalem. And we will provide the enabling ground for fertility of ideas, for production, for a better Nigeria, where everybody will be proud to be a Nigerian. You carry your green passport anywhere abroad, you will be dignified as a Nigerian. And it is P2B and Labour Party that will do that. And our manifesto, the Labour Manifesto, is the contract between the Labour Party and the Nigerian people. That contract will fulfill it. God and man being our witnesses. So, be rest assured that President Muhammad Buhari, as he had said it, that he wants a free and fair election, that free and fair election will come to pass, as had been promised by the President, the service chiefs, and the security chiefs. So, fear not. Go there and catch your vote. The rule of law will prevail because all of us are subject to the law. And anybody, no matter how mighty you are, you violate the law, the law will take its natural course on you. So go and vote. It is well with Nigeria. It is well with Labour Party. It is well with P2B as president, the incoming president. It is well with me, the senatorial candidate for River East. It's well with Beatrice Itubo, the gubernatorial candidate of Labour Party in River State. It is well with all Labour candidates that they will deliver Nigeria to the new promised land. So, go there and do the work for a new Nigeria. Thank you so very much and may God bless Nigeria. May God bless P2B and Labour Party. May God bless all candidates of Labour Party. And may God allow peace to reign supreme before, during and after the elections of 2023. And Nigeria will survive because, like late Mandela said, the day Nigeria gets it right, Africa will get it right. The inscrutable design of, Af of, of the inscrutable design of providence has been to Nigerians the responsibility to lead Africa. And it is only a purposeful leadership that can lead Nigeria to a promised land and lead Africa to a promised land. So, as Mandela has said, the day Nigeria is liberated, the day Nigeria gets it right, that is the day Africa will get it right. So, be proud Nigerian. And to be proud Nigerian, go labor. And labor will secure Nigeria.